totally destroy the hair. Mar it, yep. Mar it, then you then you're going off, which all of you Nate clowns do. Or most of you. Most of you. Let's go back. Why they don't you show my you like you show Why you lined up then? Why you lined up then? You 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 lined up. You lined up. Hold on, you notice how he cut it? Yeah, he cut, cut it again. again? <laughs> the cut brothers. <laughs> he came right back, man. Now, I agree, the brother is supposed to be wearing fringes. All right? But you know what? The law, the matter of fact, go to that Matthew 23. Go right to the point. The whole chapter is the point, really. But go right to the point, point, like around the third verse, I believe. Uh, this is uh, Matthew 23 and 3. No, 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 start at the first. Because, go ahead. Uh, then spake Yahweh Shai to the multitude and to his disciples, saying, The, the uh, scribes and Pharisees sit in Moses' seat. All therefore whatsoever they bid you observe, that observe and do. But do not... Right. That is observe and do, because the scribes and the Pharisees are telling you to keep the law. So yes, you, the law is saying, yep, when they tell you to keep the law, you're supposed to keep the law. Okay? Go ahead. But do not ye after their works, for they say and do not. And then I don't know them guys personally, but I know them guys are breaking all kind of laws, you know, behind closed doors. Go ahead. It says, uh, for they bind heavy burdens and grievous to be born and lay them on men's shoulders, but they themselves will not move them with one of their fingers. But all their works they do for to be seen of men. They make broad the phylacteries and enlarge the borders of their garments. What does it mean to enlarge the borders of your garments? It means to put them Kung Fu fringes on, man. To make them lovely, nice garments to look important. That's what the Lord was saying. And then, and then it said that it spoke about the phylacteries. Now, Nate said that the phylacteries are uh, uh, symbolic, that you didn't have to wear the phylacteries. Then why did the Lord get on about wearing, having phylacteries on, man? Because they have phylacteries on, my man. So, so Nate, Mr. Lord, man, why don't you have, where's your phylactery, man? Huh? Precept for you. Go ahead. Uh, Galatians 3, 10, and 11. For as many as are of the works of the law are under the curse. For it is written, Cursed is every one that continueth not in all things which are written in the book of the law. Uh, Galatians 3, 10, and 11. For as many as are of the works of the law are under the curse. For it is written, Cursed is every one that continueth not in all things which are written in the book of the law to do them but that no man is justified by the law in the sight of the heavenly father it is evident for the just shall live by faith so the point is in the 10th verse cursed is he that cursed is everyone that continueth not in all things which are written in the book of the law to do them so if they're going to use the law to to chastise that brother they themselves, they're not keeping everything written in the law to be justified by the law. Yeah, because they're hypocrites, man. Um, uh, James 2 and 10, it says, For whosoever shall keep the whole law, yeah, and that's their mantra, keep the law, keep the law, keep the law, and yet offend in one point, he is guilty of all. So when the brother came back, now you told him about putting fringes on, which is true, I give you credit on that, but he came back and said... Um, why you lined up? So, basically, you should. Them fringes don't mean nothing, man. Okay, you guys don't keep the Sabbath because you don't know when the Sabbath comes in. So there's a lot we got on y'all, and the then you're gonna turn around and bring up pictures of uh, 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 certain guys that supposedly are lined up, which I'm gonna check check to see if they lined up. I'm gonna have the magnifying glass out on them, man. Yeah. But this is the thing. It's just like if somebody says you committing adultery well your father committed adultery well that doesn't justify you committing adultery man right because somebody else did it man you guys are hypocrites man They're hypocrites if anybody's a scri wicked scribes and pharisees is you you dudes man let's go back you are you going simple let's so let me go simple the you lined up let's read the don't come with Ezekiel 5 no, let's read the Bible don't mean that let's read the Bible what just the Bible let's read the Bible why line up let's, let's see let's see let's read the Bible let's see why well, watch you come with Ezekiel 5 read you've been you've been a man with script now, I know what you're going to come Second with 2 Samuel come on now second they're going to bring up 2 Samuel 19 and 24 and they're going to allow I'm going to allow them to read it and I'm going to have them Ginzu knives all right, well, that's all right, brother, because we went over. Uh, let, let's 
let, let, let's, uh, let me hook that up. Okay. Yeah, like I said, I'm going to let them guys read that scripture because they lack understanding, and then I'm going to cut them with their own scripture or with the scriptures that they use. And the guy, the guy, the, guy, the, uh, the ta- Haitian Tackleberry, I got it on. The Haitian Tackleberry, he's all pumped up. He said, I'm going to get you now because we couldn't get you with the Ezekiel 5 thing, so we got a new scripture. We went back to the laboratories with uh, Elder uh, Nathaniel, and we got you, GMS guys. Well, let's see if you're going to get us. Let's go, Ock. Where's that thing at? Chapter 19. I find it amazing how you got these niggas. They're teaching about you can sleep with the white woman. You can whip young girls. You can whip women. They know no they know they're not teaching about no fridges, which is a simple law. Let's go they're not teaching about... Wait a minute. What do you mean we're not teaching about no fringes? Let's show the fringes. There's the fringes. There's the fringes. What the hell are you talking about, man? The fuck you talking about? There's the fringes, man. And the border blue. Okay? Nigga. All right, let's go back. Yeah, go to judges. Go, 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 go judges. They also teach you the name, brother. The, the name. name. Yes. You got yes. the name, yes. brother. Yes. Yes. Uh, let me get this yes. straight. Yes. If Christ comes today, I, 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 I keep the law. You're not keeping the law. But you know the name you're going to get. What law you keeping? You keep some law. You keep some law. Please. You, you, please. You, you taping up your beard. Like he, he, he got his beard cut a low, but it ain't, it ain't, it ain't lined up. Now he should have a well. You know what? Technically, technically by law, if he haven't marred his bed, then he's not breaking the law. Okay. That covers the whole ground. That shit is all over, everywhere. That's all uh, Israel. On how the so-called white men back during it's the early 1400s the came and stole the land away that, from the that, fifth that right of Native American land up. and the persecution and the genocide. The 500 or yeah, 600 year out. genocide of the native okay. peoples of this land, the, the indigenous peoples of North, Central, and South America and the Caribbean, which. Shalom, or praise to you, how about Shemi Afshar and double honors to the elders of GMS. Today I'm going to do a quick Creole topic. You know, I'm the only Levi brother here, but I'm going to have this brother help me out. He's lined up. 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 She'll be now saying these things. I want to believe what she said in the park. I want to believe what she tells me, man. Okay? But it always bites me in the ass. All the time, man. And I just want to tell you, I came out there. Be aware of these women, man. They ain't got your back. They they your enemy. Can I get some precepts on this? Get, get, get our Amos 7 and 9. Uh-huh. You know? Because I'm going through it right now. I got this woman that I broke up with. And she's starting to leave me, you know, she won't leave me alone, she keep calling me. She had some niggas, had some niggas, had some niggas, had some niggas sleeping at her house the other night and she at my house leaving candy bars on my porch. Please, you go, please, me. You taping up your bed, bro. Right? you chapter 19, verse 24. Hey, you ain't long. Hey, I'm telling you, shut up. If your niggas don't repent, you're going to die in your sin, bro. You're going to repent, bro. You're going to repent, bro. You're going to repent, you going to repent, you going to repent, guess what? Tell that nigga to have the same you thing. Go, you going to repent. All these niggas from DMS, you tell them the same thing. If you don't repent, you going to repent. You're going to repent. Repent of what? Yeah. Repent of what? Repent. Repent. Repent of what? Tell me what I'm... That.